Isobenzino is out here speaking on how his daughter Coilere has been disrespecting him throughout her career and how the labels and some media houses are turning her against him. According to Benzino, people like Angela Yee never liked him and his daughter has now become the weapon they use against him. Let's check it out. She says she slept in cars. Coin never slept in no f***ing car that I knew about. You know, I had my daughter five months out the year. I was with her mother until she was nine, then I had her from nine to 16, five months out the year, she'd be with me. She lived with me twice. She, she lived here in Atlanta with me and she went to Campbell High School. Like, I was a single dad and I was taking care of my kids, all my kids, and her two older brothers by two other men that wasn't mine. So when I'm watching this, I'm just looking at somebody, she looked like she's almost brainwashed. You know, like, she ain't never slept in no car and sold drugs and all this. Like, I don't know why she's running with this narrative. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it is crazy. I've never seen no shit like this. But the label's perpetuating it. The people who run the label, they're all perpetuating it. And then the sad thing is, like, the people who interview her, they're all down with it, too. Um, Angela Yee. Angela Yee, in 1994, was a part of a group of people who wanted Dave Mays to step down from the magazine because he put an article about me and my group, the RSO, in the magazine. Angela Yee, 1994. Imagine that. So me and her never got along. Me and, me and Angie Martinez never got along. Ever. They was biting Eminem's dick so bad that it was like, it was just, you know, it was to the point where, you know, she'd be on there, in interviewing with him and calling me that dude so they don't f with me so what is the worst thing to use somebody's child to manipulate them against him she has children she has a kid by the kid from uh cisco's group she she wouldn't want she she wouldn't want to be involved with that if some nobody would want their kid to be led into questions to go against their parents and that's what she did if you have stayed with me to this point of the video, consider subscribing. Hit the like button and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.